guys, how's it going? Here are some of the best moments of celebrities meeting their idol celebrities and even get flirty. How would you react when you meet your celebrity idol? That's a chance to wrap up when Beyonce hugged them during interview. That happened. Diane Keaton reveals she had celebrity crush on Justin Bieber. But she did not know that Justin was there and decided to surprise her during interview. In the very funny moment at the Jimmy Fallon show, they were playing a game in which you have to guess what the other person answer is. Well, at some point, Ariana Grande reveals who her celebrity crush is. Keisha once got to meet her celebrity crush, Jerry Seinfeld. But sadly for her, she got rejected. Here's the most interesting part. Cardi B getting revenge for Kesha. Hey, everybody. Thanks for coming. Thank you so much. It was... That was the opposite of what happened with Kesha. Apparently, Taylor Swift's celebrity crush was Justin Timberlake. And a couple of years ago, at the Allen show, she got a chance to meet him. So we've been hiding you the whole show. You didn't see him. We're hiding him? No, we hid you. Why did you do no, that? He was our... Charles Theron, Nicole Kidman, and Margot Robbie were playing a game of Who Would You Rather? Celebrity Edition. And well, winner of the game turned out to be Michael B. Jordan. Well, so next time when Charlize was on an Ellen show, she decided to give her a little bit of surprise and introduce to Charlize her celebrity crush, Michael B. Jordan. Can you take me with you? <laughs> Jennifer Lawrence was doing an interview when Jack Nicholson suddenly popped out of nowhere. Well, Jennifer Lawrence got super excited to meet him. No politics, Jack, no. If you want to talk politics, I love to. Oh my god, thank you. I loved all your movies. <laughs> oh, really? Do I look like a new girl, bro? I thought of it. Before Nick Jonas got married, apparently he had a crush on Amelia Clark and was a huge fan of Game of Thrones, too. He finally got a chance to meet her at BBC Radio 1. You can be a fan. I can no, I'm a huge fan. In an interview with Cardi B, when she get asked what was her dream collaboration, she quickly with responded. I would love to collaborate with one of my idols. Definitely gotta be Lady Gaga. I want to let you know that I love you. And a few months later, she got a chance to meet her at Grammys. Here you can see a very excited Cardi B. A couple of times on interviews, Emma Stone said that she was a huge fan of Spicy Girls. Well, one day on an interview while she was promoting her movie, Post decided to surprise it with a special message from Mel B. Is Mel B talking to me? Yes. Oh my god, I'm so excited. I'm legitimately crying. I'm the biggest Spice Girls fan ever. Okay, here I go. Emma, this is Mel B. Oh my god, from the Spice Girls. I want to say I absolutely adore you. I love you. That's a very excited Nicki Minaj finally meeting with her idol, Lauren Hill. <laughs> I, I, I'm in love with you. Mm. I'm in love with you. Your spirit, your mind, everything about you. you know Johnny? That's the moment when Pink revealed that she has a massive crush on Johnny Depp. Jimmy Kimmel revealed that Johnny was in a backstage and invited him to the show. Charlie Booth described to Ellen how he's a big Friends fan. So she shocked the singer by bringing Jennifer Aniston out of to meet him for the first time. Now I'm really comfortable. Now. This is good. When Instagram model Amanda Cerny went to say hi to soccer player Neymar, he apparently liked her and even winked at her after they took a picture. In the middle of the interview with Anne Hathaway, Maria Carey appeared in the background. That was the exact moment when we found out Maria was her idol. Freaking out. Like, she's two arm lengths away right now. 
Okay. I'm going to meet her at one of the, the times right. I just love that this is on camera right now. Can you? Is she in the background? I stand like this way? Okay. Jennifer Lopez's cousin had a huge crush on Cristiano Ronaldo. When they were at the club, Jennifer Lopez did the great thing for her cousin and asked Ronaldo if he can come over and say hi to her cousin. Back in 2016, Michelle Obama got really excited when she got to meet Bradley Cooper at the Ellen Show. After some flirty comments, it was clear who was Michelle Obama's celebrity crush. One of the best moments of Graham Norton's show was when Amelia Clark got to meet her longtime crush, Matt LeBlanc. Did you, get to yes. chat with everyone? you can see Amelia blushing while speaking with him. Amelia Clark loves Matt LeBlanc. Hi. Hi. Actually blushing. Um, yeah, I just think you're wicked. How are you doing? Yeah. <laughs> Kendall Jenner talked about being the same room as Brad Pitt and how she got all nervous around him. In Hollywood, and it was so good, and he just like gets better with age. So I was like, I gotta go. And they were saying like, don't ever meet your superhero or whatever. I don't know. I just like love him so much. I'm like, I'm just gonna leave it at that. It's a known fact that Billie Eilish has a big crush on Justin Bieber since she was a kid. She even made a vine about him. That's the moment when she finally met him. Well, that hug was a little too long. <laughs> When Margot Robbie and Will Smith were doing some press for the new movie Focus, Margot kind of exposed Will Smith's use of breath spray. It tastes like Christmas. It's like he's just eating a candy cane. When Sway Lee was about to leave an event, a fan came up to him and asked for a picture. And he really liked the fan, and apparently she liked him too. He even said something about taking her number, but couldn't do it because of all the cameras. When Cheryl Cole was a guest at the Graham Norton show with Michael B. Jordan, things got kind of flirty, but perhaps the most confusing signal was when Cheryl started doing some facial expressions. Sebastian Stan meets his teenage celebrity crush Sharon Stone and repeatedly flirts with her through the entire James Gordon like I've show. I've seen you all my life. <laughs> and here you are in person and you look so great. How would one ask Sharon Stone on a date in Romania? Kind of like this, Jeff Fudge. Would you bite me in the neck? Oh my god. What did you say? <laughs> Okay, you are pretty cute. I just want to throw that. 